All right, the well. At least when I lived there, I was free and I had homemade meals every day. It's a fair point, nuclear. It's a fair point. Now it's just expensive. <laughs> and you get to eat not homemade food every day. Although I will say, I do cook a decent amount. Mirstein cook pretty regularly. So at least I have that homemade food aspect still. I still can't believe the son would kill his own father. That's crazy. Expensive sadness. <laughs> what do you I mean? mean expensive happiness. You have your independence. But come on. His own father? I mean, I get angry at you sometimes. But do you? I mean, sometimes, yeah. A little. The irony of what this, this conversation is no. so I sad. Imagine not. Because the kid is like talking about how awful it is that this kid killed his family. And then Kratos is like wide eyed in the background, just like, yeah, people are awful and totally terrible when they kill their family. That is the lowest of the low. I can't imagine murdering my family. It's so sad. And Kratos really, really should tell his kid that he's a god of war and that he killed his family. I think that would be uh, probably the best bet at this point. I see something down there. I see gold. So we're currently going to get the whetstone, which is a quest for Sigil. What's his name? Sig Siggy, something. This clan really didn't want anyone coming in. It's true. How this is kind of a crazy-looking uh, fortress. Also, it was all underwater. My thought as well. Until just now. How did that not kill me? Okay. Yeah? <laughs> Your skill continues to grow. Expensive sadness. That might have been the saddest thing I've heard <laughs> in a while, nuclear. Jesus. Well, Aegis turns 18 as an officially an adult to tell him he's a god of war and that he slaughtered his entire family. I don't know, that seems like something you want to get out of way out of the way a little bit early. Just personal just personal opinions, but. Yikes. Oh, there's the wheel. Wait, I I wonder how we're supposed to get in here. Hmm. Let's must loop around from the back, so let's go ahead and do that in a second. In a little bit. The oh, wow stereotype. I do, you know what? I do, I think I like the. The stance reset. The stance reset. A triangle, do you have glasses? I actually do not. Until about a year ago, I had perfect vision, like better than perfect. 2015 uh, vision, so I had like really good distance vision and, and also really good close vision. Um, but about a year ago, right at the end of college and also coincidentally when I started streaming, uh, 
from reading so much and from staring at screens all day, I lost, like, most of my distance vision. So I probably should have, like, driving glasses. Uh, and I will at some point, but no time, no time super soon. I, it, it doesn't really bother me that much that I can't see past 10 feet. But yeah, I did not. I'm actually super lucky that way. I've never had glasses. I've never had braces. I've never had any, like, major health problems. I've had a really good life, to be honest. Notes this down on Identity Thief notepad. <laughs> God damn it, Jasper. You know it would be so easy for you to steal my identity. I don't know what you mean. It would be unbelievably easy. Same here. Ah, nice, man. Feels good. Feels good. Oh, we gotta break this chain, I think. That's what it is. Oh god, I'm getting poisoned. Do not wear glasses to ID photo sesh. And my Geo still thinks I'm lying to her about my teeth being so straight. Yeah, 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 yeah. My teeth aren't like the straightest, but they're definitely straight compared to most people that need braces. Jasper's teeth are actually straighter than mine. I actually did have one crooked tooth. It's this front, this front right one. But, uh, I knocked it out as a child. So I, like, 80% of that tooth is just completely fake, and it just straightened it out. Feels good, man. Recklessness pays off, am I right? Puts notes down on uh, identity theft pad. Get front right tooth replaced. Ah, there it is. It did work out well. Saved thousands of dollars on braces. Although, to be honest, I probably would have just had a crooked tooth. I probably wouldn't have gotten braces. I don't know, though. Maybe I would have. Okay, cool. Goodbye. Oh, God. I forgot those explode. We should be careful with that. Like it did indeed. It did indeed work out well. So I guess we're supposed to jump back through this? We open the gate. Hmm. That's where we came from. There must be some hidden passage uh, on the way in. There it goes. It allows us to loop around into this. I think. Maybe not. Ah, there we go. I am out of coffee chat. Sad days, sad times. Hmm. Hey, cool. You should, Jasper. I encourage and fully support your caffeine addiction. It's why I'm here, to be frank. Found it. There's one of the treasures! Gotta get shit done! Nice. What kind of shit are you getting done? Unyielding cinders. Incredible fire from the depths of Musel Muspelheim. Used to upgrade pommels with burn damage effects. Found in treasure map caches. Very cool. I would have liked, an honestly, I would have liked an electrical one because we. I want to upgrade our pommel one more time with the electrical stuff, DNA stuff. Are you putting extra arms on goldfish or something? Wait, what? Oh, is this just a secret area? Or there's, is there another? Not too far off. I know. I've heard you talk about it. <laughs> All right. Oh, the gate's open, so we can just take the boat. I'm glad we took that detour, though, because we found that treasure. With me. When? I don't know.
don't know. We could have easily yeah. missed that. Sometimes when you don't think I can do something, but I can. It is not always easy to know what. It's okay. I get it. I'm little. Where's that whetstone, I wonder? You are little. That's true, small child. That is definitely true. I wonder, you know what? I'm hoping that uh, Sigil, what I, I can't remember the dwarf's name. Uh, I'm hoping that he will be able to further upgrade. This is going to be bad. Focus up, boy. That didn't work out nearly as well as I thought it would. Actually, no, it worked out exactly how I thought it would, to be honest. I guess we should probably focus on the troll. We don't have rage, but if we attack a little bit, we should. Uh, I think we can stagger them as well. Oh! Alright, so heavy attacks are a no-go on the troll. Unless it's those heavy attacks, obviously. Combos, combos of the arc, arch enemy. Of the key to die. Yes, they are, dude. I actually really like combos. It's been forever since I've had combos. That's basically only carbs. Yeah, pretty much, with a little bit of cheese powder in the inside. <laughs> Mostly carbs, though. No nuclear. I want to hear about your keto diet. To be fully honest, it's a. Uh, at the very least, it's mildly entertaining because I get to feel good about all the carbs I eat. And and, and at the uh, most, honestly, I like to hear about my viewers' uh, <laughs> my viewers' lives. It's fun, guys. It's fun to share stuff. <laughs> hey, haven't had combos in forever in a day. Well, look at that. We're on the same page. However, I am gonna need a garbage plate later today. So, uh, I guess I can't really, I can't really empathize with the no carbs thing. If you insist, <laughs> if you insist, I shall continue. Yeah, dude. Never, never feel bad about updating me, dude. That's what I'm here for, right? I'm here to gossip about things and play video games. That's what makes it fun. Hmm. <laughs> Like Dagum, for instance. Better update me when he uh, sees that that surgeon at some point. I think in a couple days. All right. Hey, easy. And when his stream becomes dark humor as well. Oh, there's lore over there. Hmm. 
Hey, we can blow this up. Nice. I think I do like the the electrical arrows more than I like. Ah, is this? Wait, is this the? Is this a little area that we came behind? Wait, no, it's not. With the treasure. Cod! All the cod. The only cod. It is. Wait, is it? Let's look. What a life. What is that clip of, Jasper? Can I post something infuriating and saddening? I mean, if you want to, feel free. <laughs> if you would like to, I do generally, as a rule, prefer things that are happy and exciting. But, <laughs> but, but <laughs> I don't mind an infuriating and saddening thing every once in a while. It would be a Meeber's Alley. Oh wait, is it the... Holy shit, did you guys just see that auto-aim? That was insane. The Fortnite Scholarship, yes, I've seen this actually. Wait, what? <laughs> Convenient excuse for playing in class. Wait, why is this uh, infuriating and saddening to you? Out of curiosity. I think that's kind of cool. People embracing uh, video games on a collegiate level. So inappropriate. <laughs> no, I, I got you, man. I, I can see how that would be infuriating. I'm gonna have to permaban you for that one. It definitely would be a Meeper's Alley. That's true. Meeper's going back to school. I'm embracing video games, embracing Fortnite to play in class? That, okay. <laughs> I guess that's true. If, if it had to be a game, I my favorite one would not be Fortnite to pick. But, but I mean, I think it's all the same. It's all the same. Whatever people choose to like, I guess, kind of a little bit. I can see the saddening part of that. I, <laughs> I agree with that, Nuclear. Ooh, it's so pretty. Look at this. This game is just unbelievably beautiful. It's so good. I'm also... You know what's going to be a huge change tomorrow from this game? We're going to be playing Swords of Ditto, which is kind of like... Uh, you know that show Adventure Time? That is the art style Swords of Ditto is in. <laughs> it's like a kids roguelike action adventure sort of game. It's, I, I'm actually kind of looking forward to it, to be honest. Oh, we should probably... Oh, wait, what? There it is. But it's sort of bringing a lot of youngsters to Twitch and video games. Absolutely. Uh, video games are becoming even more popularized. I, I am not old enough to remember when, uh, like, video games were actually, like, a nerd thing. But I know that that was a thing at some point. Like, people actually got bullied for that. Whereas now, <laughs> video games are super mainstream culture, which is kind of cool. I think I prefer it this way. This is the sun. Dude, they freaking murdered this guy. The sigil. It matches the dagger we found in his father's back. He said oh. it was around, but it was not enough. Holy shit. Look at this. What was that? PlayStation just made a very weird sound. My guess, the young one muttering his dad didn't sit well with the others. He thought himself ready to lead. It cost him his life. I guess. Look there, lad. By his feet. The Whetstone. Yeah. Boss fight? Yes. I bet we're about to have they a boss fight. To smash his face in. <laughs> oh my god. Ew. That is gross. Hmm. Atreus is just like, yeah, that's cool. Hey, there it is! Luckily, we already beat a much higher level version.
Elvark coming in with the controversial comments as always. But that would that would decrease the popularity of of uh, games overall. Be known thanks to shitty titles. Eh. I can see that, Elvar. I disagree, but I uh, respect your opinion. If it's not shiny and you can't eat or drink it, might as well use it as a blunt object. So we already beat a level seven version of that guy. As you saw, he didn't stagger or take damage from axe throws, but uh, this one was much easier because he didn't one shot us every time he hit us. Epic talisman. An ancient relic of hell deemed too powerful to remain whole. Fragments of its former strength lie scattered throughout the realms. Whoa! What? It, oh wait, does it just give us... Wait, what does it do? I don't... It should grant blessing of cooldown on any successful block. I did not read the article, Dagum. I didn't have time. I'm I'm streaming. I did, however, see the uh, title. This is like saying that Fifty Shades of Grey is good because it made women read more books. <laughs> no, but if that is the comparison you choose to choose, so be it. <laughs> So wait, what does this do? It seems like it just Let's 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 check. What? That's so confusing. I don't understand. <laughs> Might be true that they're in some board shit and not good books. I mean, yes, I agree with that's true, but I don't, I don't agree that bringing more people to video games is a bad thing. I think that's a pretty flawed comparison. What? I don't know about that either, Jasper. I would say that books actually need a lot of industry help nowadays. Yeah, Dagger, I, I completely agree with that. I completely agree with that. I also doubt that very much. Wait, what? I want in here. Uh, wait. Oh, hey, Atreus. Thank you, dude. It's not. There are League of Legends scholarships. I'm pretty sure there's an Overwatch scholarship at some universities. There's a lot of gaming scholarships. That's also very true. Hmm. I mean, she needs someone to convince the big CEOs of the game. That is true. That, now, Elvar, that you finally said something that I will agree with. Uh, but on top of that, the fact that big CEOs have, in a lot of ways, messed up games is not always true. God of War is a perfect example of that. And um, even, in, even when they do mess up games, it opens the door for a lot of indie productions, which are increasingly becoming better and better. So I think there's positives and negatives to all of this stuff. 
Though we've had this conversation before. Yeah, that was a... Jasper, I watched that one as well. I watched that one as well. That was very cool. There's a Hearthstone scholarship as well. That makes sense. That just makes a lot of sense. Any big game, it makes sense for colleges to offer scholarships for them because... Um, oh, we gotta kill this other thing. Because it brings money to the school, right? What's it gonna teach you how to get lucky? No, it'll teach you how to make a career out of video games, if you want to. It'll teach you how to enter Boy. and network with uh, producers, potentially make your own game of that style if you want to later on. That's right, Nuclear made a Twitter chat! Everyone applaud, everyone applaud. When it comes to taking the money route rather than the, yeah, I, that's exactly what he said, I agree with that. Um, further concept of exclusives that should be died a long time ago. That's exactly what he said. Wait, I, I met, read your different, I read a different message. That was route since they have no, so much employees to keep hiring a single game can't guarantee. Yeah. He, he basically said he wouldn't even want to be in the shoes of, of a big company developer, a triple A title, because you have to worry about putting a roof over 300 people's I heads by making money. For example, CEOs that are making product to help boost the sales of consoles further than the concept exclusive that should have died a long time ago. Whatever you say, I love this game. I think it's fantastic. And as I always say, obviously I would prefer that exclusives didn't exist and that everyone could play every game. But if there wasn't money in games, no one would make them. So, as I always say to you, Elvar, I see both sides. Um, both sides make sense to me. Boy. We're finding all sorts of maps around here. Hmm. There's a scroll here. It belonged to the sun. Hey, wow. cool. This goes on and on. Father, forgive me. Filled with remorse. Forget my actions. Wait, why are we not applauding Nuclear for making Have a Twitter? I thought before taking action, there would be no need for regret, yes? We should be. Yeah. Maybe we should bring this to his father. That not that a great one? <laughs> <laughs> Elvar, you're so right. You're so cynical, but you're so right. They're doing so poorly on their exclusives. It's actually kind of sad and embarrassing. Where are we? Oh, we loot back around again. Hell yeah. Give me the loot. Hey, what's up, Hugo Paul? Welcome in, my man. Everything is good, dude. Everything is good. God of War is good. Coffee is good. The discussions are good. Elvar is good at being cynical, but also just in as at being a general human. Elvar, I can't wait until you're like 50 or 60. It is gonna be hilarious. You have a different schedule, right? What do you mean by that? No, we have the same schedule we've been having. Why do you ask, Paul? Hmm. You're gonna be such a great old man, Elvar. I look forward to it. Oh, we gotta find a different ex exit. Why is there no map in this area? It's kind of strange, actually. They're pro crossplay and kill exclusives. That's, they are. Was adding pro consumers while well, Sony is only trying to further the anti consumer practice of isolationism and exclusives. And they are. But the problem is, Sony's doing it really, really well and coming out with some fantastic games. The other problem is that Sony has, at least in my opinion, a lot more investment in their console than Microsoft does. Because Microsoft has gaming on their complete exclusivity over... Oh wait, we just have to go the other... We're going the wrong way. Shit! Over operating systems. Gaming on operating systems. I'm already an old man. I don't know what you're talking about. 
Elvar, you really need an emote just like this. I feel like you would get a lot of use out of it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you would. Wait, wait, no! Where am I going, chat? What am I doing? Yeah, I definitely agree with that, Jasper. Every time I would finish my stream, I haven't been able to host you. Oh, well, damn, dude. Yeah, no, we've been... Yeah, I don't really know why. We've been streaming about four hours on average in the afternoon, and then about three hours on average in the evening. Uh, and our dinner breaks have been anywhere from an hour to two hours, just like you, just like usual. Elva rant. Always, my dude. Always. The Xbox is basically a computer. Oh wait, I think this is the exit right here. Ah, there it is, okay. Yeah, this is definitely the exit. All right, perfect. We are good to go. This should be the exit, right? No, it's not the exit. Maybe, maybe we actually do have to go back the way we came. I don't know. I'm lost, chat, I'm lost. By the way, Paul, how have you been uh, enjoying... Wait, can we get through here? We can't get through. 